Hello, Hector here with Fly Rides. In my 20 years of experience of tinkering, building, and servicing bicycles, I've come across a couple tips and tricks to help you maintain your bike. On today's tech tip, we're gonna show you how to replace and adjust your bike saddle. First, you're gonna to need to put your bike on a flat position or even on a bike stand. You want to make sure that you have access to the bolt or bolts that adjust the saddle on the seat post. Now that you have the bolts in sight, you need to find the right tool for those bolts. Most likely it'll be a four, five, or six millimeter wrench that you will need to remove or at the very least loosen the bolts. If all you need to do is adjust your saddle forward or backwards, simply unscrew those bolts the same amount. If you're looking to remove the saddle and replace it, you will need to unscrew the bolts almost completely. So the saddle rails will have some markings to show you exactly what position the saddle's been in. This will help you adjust the new saddle to its correct position. With most seat posts, you won't need to remove the bolts completely. See if you can remove the saddle without disconnecting the seat post clamp. This will make reinstallation a lot easier. Now that the saddle is off, we can replace it with the new saddle. You wanna make sure that the seat post rails are aligned with the seat post clamp so you don't damage the saddle. So now what I like to do is as I'm tightening the bolts, I wanna make sure that the saddle is as level as possible. You can use a level or a hard piece of wood so you can see how flat or level your saddle installation is going. I like to tighten the bolts one at a time before I get to its final torque. You wanna to alternate tightening the front and the rear bolt so you have better control of the tilt of the saddle. If you tighten one bolt completely before you tighten the other, you will not end up with a level saddle. Position your saddle in the same position that your previous saddle was in. Tighten the bolts to spec. If your seat post doesn't state what torque to use, it's a good rule to tighten the bolts from six to 12 newton meters of torque. Once these bolts are tightened to spec, go ahead and hop on your bike and take it out for a test ride. If it doesn't feel comfortable, continue to adjust until it does. That's our tech tip for today. If you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to this channel so you don't miss another tech tip. Until next time, enjoy the ride.